Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Today in the UK it is cloudy but it is warm but it's not very sunny. Um, if you subscribe to my channel, it's a red and white subscription button, it's free to subscribe. I upload five times a week both on my travel and lifestyle channel and um, also uh, you can join my notifications from um, join my channel memberships from 99 pence a month and um, you can select which plan you want uh, um, and it's the blue and white join button and um, today i'm going to be doing a video on where can i go that is safe for holiday or day trips at this at summer up to now um so uh, number one i would uh, again it's basically anywhere like devon cornwall scotland wales it's so long as you avoid the covid hotspot each uh, for example according to the metro.uk and um, which are Salford, Manchester, Stockport, Burnley, Blackburn with Darwin, South Ripple in Lancashire so so long as you avoid those areas then you can travel to Wales or um, Northumbria or anywhere like that Scotland um, and um, obviously the hot spots were at, from the 9th of June which was yesterday so again avoid those places um, only if it's essential for you to travel because they are Covid hot spots um, you can also um, So most of the UK is it's safe to travel to. So you can go to uh, country parks, theme parks, museums, castles, beaches, parks, and stay in hotels, B and B, Airbnb, hostel, self catering, accommodation like apartments, caravans, um, camping, etc. So. Um, you've got a lot of choice there on that side of things and um, again um, I would avoid uh, traveling to outside the UK for holidays because there are not many destinations on the green list for one and um, where you have to take a COVID-19 test also um, you don't for green list country have to quarantine but most countries are on the amber list and you do have to quarantine um, for 10 days and take covid tests and um, red list countries should be avoided unless it's absolutely essential for example funerals etc um, or hospital visits um, it, unless it's absolutely essential also green and amber list countries can go on to red any time in the future so um, also also it saves you um, having to change the date of your holiday or and trying to get a refund as well and um, because a lot of companies are not giving refunds so that's another reason why I uh, wouldn't uh, book a holiday um, outside the UK um, for, uh, for this year in my opinion and if you are looking to book outside the UK I would look to book next year so I would like to say thank you for watching and um, I'll see you tomorrow and uh, Bye for now. Thank you. Bye.